Moa, and I'm with my co-host, Chiwendi Osisi Yago. And I am LJS Sapphire. It's good to have you on the show today. Yeah. <laughs> well, as you can see, we are so very excited because yeah. we are dishing it out to you the way it is. Remember, this is a program that gives you an insight on the prestigious lifestyle of a woman. Now, over the years, men have been wondering what the women really want. <laughs> Today, we are going to be exploring what a woman wants in a relationship, using ourselves as a point of contact. So, starting with my friends <laughs> here, Chichi, yeah. Safaya. I mean, can you please tell us what do you want from a guy? Yeah. Like every woman wants a particular thing from all their men. I, for example, for my for myself, I want my man to be faithful to the core. In as long as I can be faithful to a man, a man has to be faithful to me. Secondly, a man I need trust and honesty. A man I need a man to be you know to trust me. Even as much as I can be very playful and very troublesome, but at least that trust should be there and honesty. That's what basically what I want from my man. Okay, so um, a lot of people want so many things from their men. Yeah. And um, basically, um, there's no perfect man anywhere in this world. So men would always be men. They would always be what they want to be. They would always be who they want to be. Yeah. Uh, for me, I just um, want someone I can, I have a connect with. Yeah. Now when I say a connect, I'm trying to say that we have something in common. Yeah. Okay, because I, I can't be with a man, I don't have something in common. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we have to find that meeting point where at every time we are able to really come together and then really, really be what we want to be. We play, we laugh, we chase, we jump. And then that's what makes it more exciting. Yeah. But then thinking about that, so over to you. What do you want to tell us? You guys are going to be at the spot right now. Well, as a matter of fact, just like what you say, mm -hmm. a, yeah. what a woman wants from a man varies yeah. from one woman to another. Mm -hmm. Personally, I think it's unique, you know, women are very unique. Um, yeah. In as much as we behave alike, but we have our distinctive so, um, different things that we yeah. want from yeah. a man. You know, some women, they cannot date a guy if the guy is not well, or the guy yeah. is not rich. Yeah. These are the Definitely. materialistic <laughs> you know, kind of women. Yeah. I'm talking about me, I am not driven, I'm not driven by wealth. Yeah. Really it's not like I am not interested, interested. In, in, in your, you know, in a wealthy guy, but then I am not driven by wealth. Yeah. If you talk about, if you, if you, okay, you're asking me what I want from a man, let's, I want first of all, care. Yeah. In fact, the chemistry has to be there. So how is this care? <laughs> yeah. Because I really want to get. I really want. I really want. I really want you know. You know. You know. There is this thing that guys do when they meet a woman and the thing is all about sales. You know. Before you know it, a man will just meet a woman today and then the next thing is when are you coming to my house? Oh, and yeah. All that. That's what's going. That's it's, that's it's, it's quite right right now. Yeah. To me. No, but it's not so to me. me. I want the man. Let the, 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 the relationship just be established. Okay. Okay, but there's nothing wrong with the man. Oh, definitely, but then everything could just flow naturally. You understand what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. but I'm trying to just back to what I, I truly want from a man in a relationship. When we meet at first, I'd like you to treat me fairly and appealing. Mm, yeah, that first thing. Just give me a sense <laughs> of. Yeah. Yeah. Sense of love, sense yeah. of yeah. Okay, well, you mentioned you e um, equity, and then you mentioned not being concerned or not minding his money or whatever it is. I don't get. Can you help us with that too? You don't care about a man's money. Like you're saying that if the See, money yeah, is there, I don't really care when it is. Yeah, actually, well, no, 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 I think okay, I know that the man is focused. Do you understand? Okay. When you see a man that is focused, you know definitely the man will not just sit in a place and expect a man to fall from heaven. Do you understand? Yeah. The man will keep on working, hard working, and. and a man that's hard working, that you know, that has focus, you understand? But if you go to marry a man that is wealthy, probably if you guys have you probably misunderstand it, the man will remind you that, girl, you met me when I was wealthy. But it's not, it's not, it's not, that's not the case with every man. And that's not but, the case with every no, man. No, 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 because, uh, yeah, I, I hear a lot of people say, I can't get married to a broke man, I can't date a broke man. Yeah. You have to be able and willing to take care of me. Like, me. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? So I, I, can't, I, can't, I don't see any picture where you are just sitting there yeah. and feeling like, okay, 
if he has money. Okay, uh, let me get this straight. Are you trying to say that if he has money, you won't marry him at all? Ah, no, he depends. That's not what I'm saying. Okay, so I want to believe my wealthy man and marry him. Well, Sophia, before you, just before you, 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 before uh, like I've met some guys that will tell you they are just looking for a girl. You know, in fact, that they would have loved this if a girl had met them when they have not been. Yeah. So what I'm trying to say is this: it's not every woman that is interested in a man's money. Money counts. Fine. It's, it's it's very important that you meet or roll with a guy who mm-hmm. has it. Mm-hmm. But then that should yeah. be your priority. Yeah. To me, yeah. I was actually trying to tell you that money is not my first priority in a relationship. The first thing you have to give me sense of love. Yeah. Second you have to give me a sense of care then let everything flow naturally you see i don't really like a guy trying to show me his masculinity his um, telling me that he is the man oh, you know this is not really like that that we are going to be submissive to them we need to be submissive okay, okay, okay. Okay. I know the word submissive I know, I know I agree the word Why? submissive I know that we have to respect them but submissive uh, yo uh, it doesn't mean you respect your man you man doesn't respect you that's what we need submissive yeah yeah okay respect I think yeah, I agree with that but submissive yeah respect is very important yeah submissive is like there's so much to the word submissive. I no, 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 There's so much to the word submissive. Yeah, I, I agree that women should be independent, but then that doesn't mean his money doesn't count. Hello. <laughs> Yeah, it counts. It counts so much. Okay. We need the money. Oh yeah, we need more money. Do, but and that more and more be the priority. It should be the priority. You know, by well, the time, let, let me tell you something. It's one of these three. No, let's see. We can bring maybe have some, some other men as well. I'm not saying you should have all the money in the world, like have the billions. Yeah. There should be something. Okay, I met I met two people lately, mm-hmm. as late as two days ago who are the ages of um, 27 and 23 and they want to get married the boy does not even have a job he doesn't even he's still staying with his father like he literally goes to one of my neighbor's house to eat in the morning uh-huh. you understand because they are friends yeah and then he wants to marry this other girl because the father died and left the house for herself and her siblings oh, wow. so he goes to the house to sleep with her and then they want to get married so in cases like that some people are really not prepared you know, what I'm yeah. saying. People are not prepared. Now, when I'm saying prepared, the truth is whether we like it or not, money runs the world. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 The only thing a woman has to offer in a relationship is sex. Yes. And then they now create this impression that men offer money. It, it now looks like a business. Yeah, yeah. The woman gives you sex and then and you get money. It's not longer a yes. romantic relationship. Is there anything wrong with you having sex with a man and a man giving you money? No, 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 let it not be that the man is giving you this money because he is expecting something in return. No, he's appreciating. He's appreciating. Oh, really? Appreciation. <laughs> <laughs> Show me I'm against it. I'm not against it. I'm not yeah, against yeah, yeah. it. Hello? I'm not trying to say you should yeah. pay. But what I'm trying to say is, I mean, when somebody has sex with you, you just give them something, you know? Ah. It's disrespectful. <laughs> you know, I, I, feel, I feel like it's disrespectful when a guy wants to have sex with a lady and then you just say, ah, thank you. Baby. No, listen. And listen, then, listen. And then that's why it comes like, do you mind? I love you. And I'm like, oh, okay. And then the next thing, when you just leave, he starts picking your call. And then we end the case here. And then he starts saying, you know, you no, broke yeah, my heart. Oh, like, oh, no, no. <laughs> okay, okay, a guy can sleep with any girl. Yeah, I was with a guy okay. that was really, really saying he loves her and he loves, he loves, he loves. And then I was all like, oh, okay, yeah, it's good, it's cute, it's okay. And then we're all together. And then all of a sudden, this, yeah. this call kept coming in. And then I was like, I don't want to be here. Why don't you want to pick this particular one? Because this number has been calling the whole day. And then all of a sudden, he gave his phone to check a video that he saw on the internet. And then the message just came in, you hurt my feelings and it offends me. I'm like, yo. <laughs> I know you said this person is your cousin. How come? He said, no, it's not that number. It's the other number. Like, okay, what, what's with the other number? What, what's, who's this person? And he was like, well, they just had a one night stand and then that was it. And then he paid the girl and she went off. But she wants more. Oh my yeah. gosh. Wow. When she wants more, she wants because this is an American dude now. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. So, what do you tell me? Well, so, I can imagine they, this this yeah. situation. Yeah. 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 Well, so she wanted right. more. And but I was all like, I mean, how much did you pay this girl? Like how much? How much came in? And then all I heard was, well, 
I just gave out three k. Wow. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's very insulting. Because well, it, it was actually because, of, it was actually because of where he picked up from. Wow. You know, the thing starts with you as a woman. Okay. You need to want more for yourself. You need to want more from where you meet this man, how you meet him, and then where it takes you. Oh, yeah. Now that brings us down to the independent woman. Yeah. I am this person that doesn't feel that a man should do everything for you. Yeah, definitely. But I'm telling you again and again that your money counts. <laughs> Why are you just have money? Because I'm money on the table. The truth is, if you tell a man today that you have one million naira, tomorrow he'll tell you, babe, my mom just fell sick, she's about to die, please. And there's this one million that uh, you are saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. You, you know how luck could be, right? Especially when you're already into this thing, and then it's all like maybe all the parents are involved, and everybody knows this person already, and it's all like, okay, this money has yeah, to come, and then you just yeah, need to yeah, it. And then yeah, yeah, but, but you listen, are into it. Yeah, you can't leave her because, because, because of what you're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it may not be like you're right now. Okay, you know. A man, I feel, should be able on his own to take care of a woman. On his own. Yeah. How, how do you look at it? Even if the woman is rich. Of a, instead of a, whim, a woman. That's not what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. The money counts. The yeah. money counts. Because it has but to But you know that these guys, I feel the reason why uh, ladies normally on their own ask for these money is because some of them don't make use of their senses. Do <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because okay, so you man, saying this, a man, it's wrong a man, to ask a man for money? Actually, to me, it's not in my DNA. Yeah. Like, it's very, very untypical of me to ask a guy for money. Yo, but yes, I have a lot of time. I always, I always yeah, I get guy, to see about it before I ask the guy for money. Yeah, if the guy... just come up and say, please give me money. I am. I, I, I always wish okay, that guy I should tell you that somebody should No, it depends on the relationship you have with No, because, you know, there is this impression that guys have about women, you know. Yeah, yeah. You know, a woman meets a guy today to marry. He wants to make money. her hair. He wants to buy fix her nails. And then the guy things. feels that this yeah. lady is just interested in the money. So to me, if there should be this, uh, you know, where of a guy on his own, knowing that this is his responsibility, you should well, be able to care about it. When a guy says he's behind his neck, <laughs> and he doesn't want to have sex. What do you do in that case? I feel that's the reason why ladies on their own. Hello, I'm going to ask you for the money, dude. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to ask him for the money because if you're not using your sense, I mean, that's what a gentleman right, yeah, 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 I, 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 I can't use my transport to come to your house and I should use my transport to go back. Some yeah. guys only does. Some guys don't, don't have it. That way. They don't have it because you need to tell them. Oh, yeah, you need to, so the yeah. truth is, men really need to be taught. At every point in time, they need the lesson. It, it has to just go. Well, remember you have a brother. Well, I teach my brother because sometimes he came to me one day and he was like, Oh, babe, and my, my girlfriend, she kept picking my car. And I was like, What was the last time you sent her money? And they've been together for quite some time. And well, this is the same girl I know that sent money to him. Wow. So, yeah, and he sent me the same money to her. Yeah. They, they, they both, they're, they're together. So, but when was the last time you it's, it's money, girl. This Harry's time is it's so <laughs> it's very it's so difficult. It's not about the saying that says all men are the same. Yeah, they're, they're you think always they're true. You need to always tell them. Do you think that it's, 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 it's no, 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 that's all the topic for the next time. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I want to clarify something. So, oh, yeah. 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 Okay, but, but I think we should answer that yeah. question particularly. Mm -hmm. We're talking about men cheating. Men will always be men. They are just polygamous people, and then that's what they are. But the, the, the money aspect, we want more. We want more from the money, from the care, to the love, to yeah, whatever it is we have to give yeah, to definitely. us. Into, 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 we want more of it every time. But don't get twisted. Or oh, oh, nobody's perfect. <laughs> yeah, nobody's perfect. Nobody's perfect. Well, that's where it comes to that we have to teach them. Person. Because men are babies. Yeah. A baby? Okay, <laughs> I said that. I said that. I said, I said men are babies. They oh, always yeah. Do you need them to? Okay, I, I noticed that. My age grade, like people that I'm on the same age yeah, range yeah. with, like uh, the, the opposite sex and guys, they don't think in line with what I think. And I also notice particularly and straightforwardly that my elder brother doesn't think the way really? I think. <laughs> I you think, no, I'm baby. not trying to say he thinks yeah. like a baby, okay. but, but most times yeah. he acts like one. Because even around you, can you just sit down outside and like, like can, can you give me, I, I need my food. My, my water. No, that's, that's, that's how babies behave. And then, uh, that's, that's our side. Men also want you to remind them that eh, they need to give you money for food. They need to give you this. They need to buy clothing. They, they, they want to be reminded. But yeah. not knowing that, for you to be called a man and not a boy, all of this comes with a <laughs> responsibility. <Yeah. laughs> all right, all right. That's, 
the much we can take yeah, today yeah, on yeah, this yeah, episode yeah. of Guest Hangers. I hope you found it very interesting. Yeah, definitely. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Next time we're going to be giving you something very hot. Something more hot. Hotter than this. Yeah, hotter than fire. Sometimes <laughs> I mean, like, yo, yo, yo. Yes, yo. 